Hi all, this is Chandra Shekhar on behalf of Mission SK. Today I am here with an important topic of bioinformatics, multiple sequence alignment. Multiple sequence alignment may be simply defined as doing sequence alignment of multiple sequences as the name def- as the name suggests. But such simultaneous alignment of several sequences has led to many important results regarding common sequence patterns or motifs in the proteins or nucleic acids. For example, one of the common goal of building multiple sequence alignment is to characterize the protein or gene families and to identify shared regions of homology. This often happens when a user has to run a BLAST or a FASTA type of sequences in a database RW, to be installed in your thing. Now I already have it, I no need to do that. And to enter, after you are finishing that, you just enter into the program just by typing cluster RW, the name of that program. Now I got that. I am having the version cluster LW of 1.83 and it's simple to use. I will say by step by step. The first thing is to input the sequence from the disk and one more thing you should remember if you are inputting the sequence from the disk you should be in the particular folder. See I am in al- <coughs> I'm already in the pro- folder called desktop. <coughs> sequence, f- sequence input from the disk. First press number 1 to get the sequence from the disk. Then enter the name of the file. I am having the file name as 40 sec. Dot. After entering you may get uh, just I have given the primate sequences, primate protein sequences of oh, 40 primates. This includes human, chimps, gorilla and also some vertebrates related to a primate group to check the homology of the sequences. You can observe 38 sequences which I have given here. Then after inputting the sequence, you should go to number 2, doing multiple sequence alignment, multiple alignment. After given your choice, just press enter. And you will be asked for choosing your option. Go to an option 2, uh, sorry, go to an option 9 so that you can set your output parameters. What are the output you want? You can get the output in different formats like FASTA, cluster W, PAR format and other different format. See, if you, for example, I want PAR format, I should press 2 and press enter so that it may get, you may observe here, PAR format on. But I don't want that, I can again press 2 and off that. And I want cluster W format, that ARN format is often required out as an output of MSA. So it's already there. So we can return return to our uh, main options. Now if everything is paka, now you can go to do multiple sequence alignment by pressing the choice 1. And you just, if you want to your output file name, you can type your file name. If not, leave it to default. And similarly for DND also. Now let the program to run. Uh, actually cluster W is doing progressive alignment. You can observe here, it's it's between 1 and 2, 1 and 3 like that, 1 to 36. Similarly, 36 to 36, 36 to 36 it will observe. Here our sequences we have 38, right? So it will take time. Babu. Now you observe the output of cluster W. In the forthcoming lectures, or the f- uh, com- forthcoming videos, we can come to know how to analyze the sequences, the output of cluster W. Thank you. Thank you for joining us.